This is the Tilt View wireless charger. Hi, Dan from Gear Diary. Today we're taking a look at two different accessories from Tilt. This is an accessory manufacturer that we came to know about a year ago, and we have been loving their products. They are incredibly functional, decently priced. They're not cheap, but they're decently priced, and they are all unique in their aesthetics and their functionality. This is the Tilt View wireless charging stand. It has an MSRP of $69.99, and it comes in four different colors. Now, it looks like a simple desk stand where you can take your uh, smartphone and simply place it there and have it at a really good angle for viewing. And it is that, but it is key enabled. That means that you can plug in a wall adapter right here, included obviously, and simply have this on your desk or your nightstand and put your smartphone that is key enabled right onto it to have it start charging immediately. That's great if you have a phone that's designed to simply be placed on it and the phone is key wireless charging enabled. But what do you do if you've got something like this? This is the Samsung Galaxy S5. It is designed to be key wireless charging compatible, but it does not ship with the compatibility built in. Well, that's where another accessory from Tilt comes in. The Tilt ViewMate is a wireless charging receiver card, and it, there's one for the Galaxy S4, one for the Galaxy S5, and one for the Galaxy Note 3. The cards for the S4 and the Note 3 are $19.99, the one for the Samsung Galaxy S5 is $24.99, a few dollars more, but then again, this is a brand new product for a brand new phone. So let's take a look at it. This right here is the wireless charging card. This is the ViewMate, the converter card. So we're gonna pull the stand out of the way, and there are a few steps to putting this on. It's not complicated whatsoever, but you do want to do it carefully and slowly. So the first thing to do, obviously, is to pull this off. Now, before I do that, why do I want to make this wirelessly charging enabled? Well, it's a nice convenience with any phone, I would expect. But in this case, the S5 has water-resistant technology. And in order to get that going, to get that to work, they had to put a door over the USB charging and sync access point. It's fine, except for the fact that it, A, you need to dig your fingernail in there, and B, it's really, really delicate. And I can see pulling this off if you're not careful each time. This is a phone that needs to be taken care of, be treated relatively delicately because it is plastic on the back and the sides. But I don't want to treat it so carefully because I need to worry about this door here. So by having it key enabled, I never have to or rarely have to open this door whatsoever. So the first thing you do, obviously, is pop off the back cover of the phone. Now the way that this is going to work is this is the wireless charging converter card and if you flip it over it has two contacts there and they correspond to the two spots right here. So you're going to be placing the contacts right there so that they fit into there and then you're going to be placing the card here on the battery. Now you do want to use the included tape that's on the other side to hold it in place. And then once it's there, it's nice and steady. And because it's only sealing to the battery, you can actually remove the battery if you want to do swappable batteries. Now one of the questions that I had, and it's been answered in some of the forums I've been looking at, is whether or not this maintains the water resistant aspect of the phone. We're going to say water resistant. Initially, Samsung was saying that it was waterproof and they've changed their, their wording because it is really water resistant more than waterproof. This is the seal that keeps it so and it may be, it says in literature, it may be compromised by the use of this accessory. For me, it's a decent trade-off. So, very carefully just take off the tape. Flip it around. The most important thing is that these contacts are lined up properly, so they're lined up. It's now lined up with the battery, and that should do it. Now, when I place the cover over the phone, there are going to be two things that I expect. Number one, it's going to be raised up just a little bit, and it may bump out a little bit. As I said, it does report that it may compromise the water resistant integrity of the design. I can live with that. So
So there we go. The case is back on. I really don't notice that there's anything here. If I put my finger over here like this, I can feel that it rises just a tiny bit, but it's really not noticeable and it's really not something that any normal person is going to really worry about all that much. So now I've got the ViewMate on my Samsung Galaxy S5. There's no way to know it's there other than to be really picky or to remove the cover. And that's really the idea here. This is now a wireless charging enabled phone for under 25 bucks. So now I've got my Samsung Galaxy S5 and if I place it on, it now within a couple of seconds says wireless charging enabled and it's now wireless charging. If I pull it off, it stops charging. And one of the nice things about the Tilt View wireless charger is that you can take it horizontally and place it down like that. And within a few seconds, it tells you that it's wirelessly charging. So the other thing that I wonder is, will this work if you have a case on the phone? So this is the Spec Candy Shell Grip. Nicely protective, and it's now in place. And if I place it on the key charger, it does work right through the case. And this is a fairly thick case. Let's also check it out in landscape. And it works there as well. So you can use a case as thick and as bulky and as dense as the spec candy shell grip and the ViewMate and the View will work together to give your Samsung Galaxy S5 wireless charging. So this is the Tilt View wireless charging stand. It comes in four colors. It has an MSRP of $69.99. It allows you to place any or almost any key wireless charged phone on it and get it charging without having to plug anything in. And we've looked at the Samsung Galaxy View Mate. This is a wireless charging converter card that turns the Samsung Galaxy S4, S5, or Note 3 into a wirelessly enabled phone. The ViewMate has an MSRP of $19.99 for the Note 3 and the S4. The S5 is $24.99. The Tilt View is $69.99. They're all available now. This is Dan from Gear Diary. Thanks very much for watching.